Lee, your thoughts after an absolutely fantastic 3 2 away win tonight at Hartley Whitney? Yeah, it was. Um, listen, it's come at a great time for us. We've got to remember what, we're, what the boys have been on, you know, chipping them away last Tuesday, uh, Saturday with 10 men after 15 minutes. And coming to a Hartley and Whitney side that are in form, for me, listen, there's so much time and respect for Millers. I think he's one of the best managers in the league in terms of what he does for uh, in terms of budgets and what he produces. I know he's only interim at the moment, but it's probably come at a worse time for us with him coming back in because he gets a tune out of his players. And um, listen, I hope he stays on, but by what he's saying, he might not, but he's, he's a very good manager. And we knew what we was going to come up against. We didn't start great. Again, we, we've conceded early, but the, the character after that, I thought was fantastic. We've worked so hard tonight. And then, you know, we, we, we get ourselves back in the game. Brooksy scores a great goal. and. It was just a very even game, I thought, all night. It was just very end-to-end. -end. That's the way they play. They stay four up front, and they're very good at it. And, you know, we scored just before half-time, good goal. And, and I felt we come out second half, to be honest, and didn't start great. And um, we didn't keep the ball well enough, and we invited pressure. And, listen, lo and behold, we've had a man sent off for last man. Just spoke to referee there. I think if they don't get their man sent off, if that had happened the other way around, I'd, I'd have been annoyed. But to allow the play to go on for so long, them nearly score, us make a great tackle, then to call it back three kicks, sending off was a little bit harsh. But I think it probably, you know, last man is a sending off. And no gripes for that. And then the character with 10 men was, was fantastic. And um, I just thought it was a, an all-round... It wasn't pretty, it wasn't nice. It just a, just a, an honest performance for the football club. What does this do now for the confidence of the team? Because we've been on the receiving end of, you know, we could argue some difficult decisions and we've performed well but not got the result. We've actually seen this over the line now. Yeah, I think it's big. Um, I think if we go back to the first six games of the season, we were good. We wasn't poor. Uh, we made poor decisions and, and we're working on that and trying to stop that. And then in the... In the we have to remember, before Saturday, up to Chippenham, I think we were eight games unbeaten. Um, one of them was on penalties, but up to then we were we were doing very well. So it, you know, it wasn't all doom and gloom around the club. It, it, the boys are the boys are playing extremely well, um, but it's a belief and, and hopefully a confidence because we've got a good group, um, and I think we on our day could, uh, match for anyone. But we've got to stop the inconsistency. We've got to tighten up on the discipline because even now it's a red card. It's last man. Marcin on Saturday harsh, but it was still last man. Uh, a handball. So these little things that we've got to tidy up because. You can't keep getting away with it. We can't keep playing with 10 men. But as a confidence booster in there, it's good for them because to win with 10, to score a goal with 10, to hold out for 15 minutes with 3-2 with from an own goal from us, it was great character and I'm extremely proud of the players tonight. So I suppose it makes us look forward to Saturday uh, a little bit more than normally we would have done. How is the squad looking health-wise and fitness-wise? Yeah, listen, we've, we've still got some suspensions. We welcome one or two back. We lose Brooksy um, for his own doing. We, we're waiting to find out the appeal for, for Marcin. So we're, we're, we're depleted, but we're a wounded animal as well. So, you know, they know that what they what they need to do. They've got to work hard. I've watched Gosport this year. Got a very, very good side. Um, and, and I still think they'll be right up there at the end of the season. They've got a good manager and they've got very good players, individually very good. And as a team, they're strong. So we have to match what we've done tonight. We have to perform like we've done tonight. And, and even more so, give a little bit more on the ball because I felt at times we could have tidied our play up. Great to get some minutes into Sean Lucian as well. I thought Robbie Buchanan was excellent. The, the kid up front and Brooksy, Joe and Brooksy, were, I thought were exceptional tonight. The, the shift that they've put in tonight was was brilliant. And, and a special mention, I thought, to Josh DeWoody as well, fielding at left back. And um, I thought it was outstanding. So it gives us confidence. Does it mean we've done anything? Absolutely not. You know, we need to go and get on a, a little run here if we can. But it's going to be very hard with Gospel Paul coming up and, and Dorchester after that. So no easy games in this league. I'm expecting a real tough one on Saturday. We'll assess the squad Thursday and then out and we'll go from there. Josh, yep. a fantastic three points um, in a tough away game. How do you feel now after we've had a really bad run of results? It was great. Um, it's, it's nice to go home to a win, especially on a Tuesday night. So I can't complain. So what pleased you most about the team performance tonight? The three goals, because we've struggled to score so far this season, so I think three goals away from home when we've been in a bad run of form like that is, is great. And to be down to ten men for, for most of the second half, that must have been pleasing as well, that resilience that we showed. Yeah, 100%, because we did the same thing on Saturday, but obviously it's different with a goalie getting sent off, but to concede six and then come in and concede one, which is just an own goal, which 
you know, happen sometimes is 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 good. Like we should have even kept a clean sheet. I think it was even better with the ten men when we calmed down after the first 10, 15 minutes of the second half it was a bit frantic. But after that, nothing. So you've played for us left back, right back. What's, what's your best position? Would you say? Um, either one. They're both the same to me, to be honest. I think so. Either one, I'm happy just to play, to be honest. And how are you finding your time at Hendon this yeah, season? Yeah, great. Every, all the lads are good. Great. Change room's been great. Despite like, all the bad form and everything, the change room's still in high spirits and everything. We believe we can climb up the table. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm happy. And looking forward to Saturday. It's another tough match. It's golf sport, but we're at home. Yeah. But, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully keep this, um, this form. Win again. That's all I can say, really. I just enjoyed winning today. Josh, it's been a pleasure.